hi guys welcome to my channel guys in this video i am going to show you how you can make this side nav bar in just simple html and css first of all we have on the left side our hamburger icon whenever you click on this hamburger icon the side nav bar will appear these are our links and whenever you want to close this nav bar you just have to click on this cross icon the side nav bar will be closed and this nav bar is completely responsive you can see this in your ipad mobile or any type of devices this is completely responsive so before starting this video i will request you guys that please subscribe to my channel and if you have any related question then you can ask me in the comment section so okay guys here i have one html file i am starting with html first of all i am taking one section with the class of main and inside this section I am taking one div with the ID of navbar and the class will be overlay so inside this navbar I am taking one anchor link inside this anchor tag I am using a class of close button this anchor tag will be for this cross icon whenever we open our sidebar menu and and if we want to close this sidebar menu we just have to click on this cross icon for that i am taking a class of close button and after that i am taking uh, the class the navbar content for that i am taking one div with the class of content and inside that is inside this content i am taking our uh, links first of all i am taking home and let me copy this four time home and the second one is about the third one is services and the fourth one will be blog and after the nav bar, I am taking one span tag. This span tag is used for this hamburger icons. Whenever we click this uh, on this uh, hamburger icon, the side nav bar will be appeared. So for that, I am designing this hamburger icon. First of all, I am taking the style inside this tag. First of all, I am taking font size. Font size will be 30 pixel, and the cursor will be pointer and I am taking padding uh, top bottom and uh, left and right will be 30 pixels and the color will be white as well. okay and uh, for this hamburger icons I am taking a code that is actually our icon code for that I am taking the hamburger icon code that is and hash nine double seven six and a semicolon this is our hamburger icon code that is either this code is actually our hamburger and for this cross icon i am taking the code of this cross icon inside this uh, anchor tag with the class of close button and the code for this and the code for this cross icon is and times and this is the cross icon okay so now let me design the css for this side nav bar first of all i am taking a style tag inside this style tag first of all i am going to design this uh, this nav bar with the class of hourly first of all i am taking the height that is 100 percent and width will be zero and the position is fixed and z index will be one and top margin is zero and the right left margin is all as well also zero and the background color is white and also i'm adding one more background color that is actually our transparent uh, background color are this transparent background color 
I am adding RGBA. The red will be nine, and the green will be three, and the blue will be eighty-seven, and the alpha will be zero point nine. So this is our background transparent color, and I am ad adding our flow X that is uh, hidden. So after that, I am taking our transition time that will be uh, zero point. Five second. So after that, I am going to design the content or this content with the class of content. For that, first of all, I am taking our position that will be relative, and the top margin will be fifteen percent, and the width will be hundred percent. And text align will be centered and margin top is 30 pixels after that I am going to design our anchor tag that is actually inside the overlay now I'm going to design the anchor tag every anchor tag that is inside our uh, every anchor tag uh, that is our inside this overlay class I am going to design this anchor tags First of all, I am taking padding 8 pixel top and right, left and right, and text decoration will be none, and font size, and the font size is 36 pixels, and the color will be like uh, this of uh, 6 times F, and the display will be and the display will be black and the transition for this to hidden that is at 0.5 seconds and now I am going to design the hover effect the hover effect on this icon whenever we hover on these uh, links the background color is white with the hover effect of white background color so let me design the hour the hover effect for this whenever we click on this whenever we hover on this the color will be like white uh, the color is black and the background color will be white so this is our hover effect on our links and now i'm going to design this close button the position will be absolute and top margin will be 20 pixels and the right will be 45 pixels and font size will be 60 pixels okay and for this main section I am taking one background image that is our background URL and copy dot jpg and no repetition and the background size will be cover the background size will be cover and the height will be 100 vh so this is the rcss for this side navbar let me see the output so this is our CSS let me tag the universal tag here the margin margin 0 padding 0 
and the box size battery box so let me see the output for this so now you can see this is our this is same so this is our output but whenever we click on this uh, hamburger icon it it never shows the size nav bar for that i am using our javascript whenever we click on this hamburger it show this side nav bar so for that i am using javascript little bit of javascript here so in the end in the end of this section i am taking i am taking a script tag first of all i am taking one function uh, the name will is was uh, the name will be uh, open name open navbar this is our function and this is the function body and whenever uh, we click on the hamburger icon it shows the side navbar so for that i am taking document dot get element by id whenever we click on the id when whenever we click on this id navbar it shows us the size navbar style dot width click on this hamburger icon it shows us the size navbar with the 40% of width so uh, I am going to take another function that will be for close nav. This is our function, and I am going to copy this and paste it right over here. Whenever we go, this function is used for whenever we click on this, it shows us the sidebar, and if we want to close this sidebar, and if we click on this cross icon it's close the side navbar so for that i am taking this uh, with the zero percent whenever we click on this side navbar the width of this side navbar becomes zero percent so it will disappear so uh, we use this function right over here inside the javascript now i am calling this function right over here inside this uh, close hamburger and cross icons so for that right here I am taking I am calling the function with the on click whenever we click <coughs> whenever we click on this uh, hamburger icon it's uh, it open it calls this function and I am going to copy this on click function from this from here and I am going to copy it right over here so whenever we click on this it it called the close function close nav function so this is so this is our uh, and one thing is remaining uh, when, uh, this is our tag hang, hang, reference uh, here i am taking the javascript dot white zero so now let me see the output for this let me refresh this you can see whenever we click on this it shows us this but the font size is not the same as this the font size is uh, like bold and if you see this this is our output whenever we click on this it will not closed so let me see the function that is close now so here now you can see the output for this whenever we click on this hamburger icon it shows us the side nav bar and whenever we click on this cross icon the sidebar nav is disappeared so this is our side side, man, side nav bar and if you like this video then please hit the like button and for more video you can uh, click 
on the links in the and for more video you can click on the links in the descriptions for for now it is over and if you like this video then please subscribe to our channel thank you